I'm sitting here once again amongst the pieces of the Tara facade. Tara in Gone with the Wind. As I said earlier, just to reiterate, let folks know, Tara was not an actual building. It was a scaffolding covered with uh, windows and doors and a brickwork that was made out of, some called it paper mache, others called it uh, hardy board. My friend, the late Fred Crane, who was uh, Brent Tarleton in Gone with the Wind, said it looked like it was cut, actually, to, uh, to look like brick. Well, I think we found some brick. I just picked up a piece of wood, and if I may, I'll try to pick this up and show you what the brickwork looked like in Tara. Behind this piece of uh, molding, you can see it almost looks like a brick. It has a pattern to it. It looks like it reminds me of some of the uh, MDF, uh, the uh, stamped um, um, manufactured plywood that actually you'd see the pattern looks like the back of some moderately priced, shall I say, dressers and furniture like was in my house growing up. Uh, that's what it looks like. I'm talking off camera to my, my friends here all going, yeah, yeah, that, that does make sense. On the other side, painted to look like brick. And so this would be one of the pieces. Now when they moved the facade from Hollywood, they tore the scaffolding down and took the brickwork and burned it in a pile there on the set. What they shipped to Atlanta was the doors, the windows, the hardware, the side porches. So very little of the brick uh, exists and this appears to be one of them. I have here sitting next to me some pieces of the original front door of Tara. Now, uh, when uh, the front door was restored and then loaned to the Atlanta History Center, they had to rebuild the side lights, the framework. So we have some of the original pieces of the side light here in storage with the rest of the facade. In fact, I don't know if you can see this on camera. It says Tara fan light jam, piece of the original curvature at the top of the door. You'll see also over here next to me some other pieces of the fan. And then there was a side window that had a fan. Uh, as Hattie McDaniel sticks her uh, head out of the, the upper story window to, to call down to Scarlet at the beginning of the movie, to her left, just past the fireplace, uh, chimney is another window with a, a curved top and that's what this piece is from. So you can see it's like a giant puzzle. <laughs> there are pieces everywhere and they are identified. So we are able to take a lot of these pieces and know exactly where they go. But once again it's going to take probably not as much uh, big time scientific stuff as just a lot of elbow grease. Trying to clean this place up so that one day very soon folks can come and see the Tara that it seems like so many folks have been looking for all these years.